Yo, 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 another day, another adventure with your homeboy Jermaine and getting this vlog started off. Yeah, right now I am in, um, I'm in San Francisco and I'm in, uh, I'm walking down 3rd Street. Yeah, this is 3rd Street. Now, 3rd Street was one of those places that I've always wanted to come, but I just haven't made my way around 3rd Street. And a lot of people put in the comments, Jermaine, go explore 3rd Street. So I thought, okay, let's go explore 3rd Street. So it's Sunday morning. It's really, really early in the morning. Good morning. It's really, really early in the morning. And um, someone waving at me in the car. And I thought that, uh, yo, let's, let's go out and do it. Let's go check out 3rd Street. The first thing I noticed, I got a lot of brand new lime scooters here. And, uh, you know, I don't see any homeless people here, you know, for the most part. Now, like I said, I'm filming this early in the morning, so it's not a lot of action going on, but it's also not a lot of action because of, you know, COVID-19. So there's definitely gonna be less people walking around. Don't have the skateboard today. Thought about making a walking video. And uh, yeah, this is Third Street. Now, like I said, I don't just really come to Third Street. Third Street is kind of far from downtown. Like, it's kind of far. You can just take Third Street and go all the way down. The same Third Street that, that connects to downtown. You can take that same Third Street and get all the way out here. But like I say, it's kind of a long way. And that's one reason why I don't really just come to Third Street. Now, there's not a lot of action going on like this early in the morning. And I kind of just was sort of making a freestyle video. Um, I'm, I've been hanging out with, uh, with a friend in this neighborhood and, you know, yesterday it was raining. Well, the day before yesterday it was raining and then yesterday, like, um, we were like busy in the East Bay doing something and I actually didn't, didn't vlog anything, which I probably should have vlogged some things because we went to this really, really amazing vegan restaurant, restaurant, but you know, sometimes you, you just don't vlog every single thing. It's third Street, yo. Now, one thing about the Bayview area neighborhood, which is like over in this area, I think over here is like a, a different neighborhood, if I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong. Like I said, I don't, I'm not a professional. I don't come to this part of town much. I don't know. I'm, I'm like so thrown off. Like I'm lost here. Super burrito and seafood. So this is a uh, super burrito and seafood. So my guess is they sell burritos and they sell seafood. Now people talk about gentrification, you know, the Bayview, this neighborhood. And from what I've heard, it they sort of they sort of started it. That's why they did like they made all the lights like modern and they made all the they put all these crosswalks and stuff here. This is what I just hear from locals, that they they tried to make Third Street nicer than they made Mission. And I mean, I don't know, if you kind of look at Third Street, it actually looks like the street itself. It actually does look nicer than Mission, you know? It, it, it kind of does. But also Mission Street, those buses that drive down Mission Street all the time. And there's no, but I don't think there's many buses drive down this street because of the, um because of this, uh, they got a train above above ground. So the less buses you have on the street, the, the buses don't destroy the street as much. So, you know, I guess that's one reason why Mission does look a lot better. I guess that's one reason why Third Street does look a lot better than Mission. And once again, like as I've been walking around today, like even in this video, and also as I've been walking around ever since I've been here, like in the Bayview because I've, I've actually been hanging out here for a couple days now I haven't been I haven't been back to the hotel in a minute that's why I don't have the skateboard because the last time I came here it was raining so I didn't bring the skateboard long story long story long story but anyway what do we have here 
if I'm not mistaken, the freeway is like right down here. But then if, if also, if I'm not mistaken, this is, um, there's like the Home Depot and the loads down this way. Wow, look at the artwork over here. Yo, no joke, this looks like a whole different part of the city, yo. Look how, look how big the streets are. It's a whole different part of the city, yo. Yo, please don't be watching my videos talking about, yo, this is the place we're gonna go buy up and gentrify. Like, come on, don't be doing that. But yeah, this is like, this is what it looked like on 3rd Street, yo. Look at the post office over there. At least they got a post office that's an actual post office. And then of course, of course, we're going to have a McDonald's close by. Because you always got to have a McDonald's nearby. But I'm going to keep it real. It's not a lot of McDonald's in the city. It's not like other places. It's not like New York. Like, gosh, man, there's McDonald's everywhere in New York. I don't know about today. Then look at that car. <laughs> like somebody doing work on it. It's all jacked up, parked on the side of the road. <laughs> Yeah, it's quiet this morning. Wow, it is super quiet. This is super quiet, yo. But you know what? Like, I kind of wanted to film this video when it was like quiet, when it's like not too much going on. Cause Third Street can be lit on the weekends. And I'm pretty sure it'll be lit later today. <laughs> pretty sure it'll be lit later today. Now, another thing about Third Street, we got to talk because, yo, we, we got to jump on Third Street, yo. Because, like, I'm not going to just come here and just, like, paint beautiful pictures. This train, right? The train's not running because of COVID, all right? I get that. But even when the train is running, it'll take you forever to get downtown. And that's because... Like, there's so many lights, there's so many stops, like, there's just a lot of obstacles. So it's like, it's a train, but it's like, it's a train that I would not want to be riding all the time. Coming way down here from deep, deep down in third, you know? But this will kind of be equivalent from, from living at like, uh, like Gary Street by the ocean. This is what this will be equivalent to. But the thing is, living Gary Street out by the ocean, you can hop on the um the 38, the rapid 38, and get downtown a whole lot faster than you can, you know, taking one of these trying to get downtown from here. That's kind of the bad, bad drawback. And it's it's just more lights over here. Those lights, those lights on Gary Street, they just flow easier than these lights. Third Street, Third Street. So, in Third Street, you guys may want to know. Now, the, the, the people who wanted me to make this video, you already know who lives here. But um, people who are just new tuning in, what's up with Third Street? So, Third Street, the Bayview, for the most part, it's deep down far out in the city a lot more locals you definitely don't find many techies living in this neighborhood before the pandemic maybe you would find a a, a, a few but the bayview this is pretty much known as a local neighborhood yeah it's pretty much what it is it's uh it would be like a local neighborhood like you you would really meet some some down-to-earth cool san francisco people in this neighborhood You'll easily meet people who have lived here generations in this neighborhood, you know? So, that's the thing with the baby. And, uh, yeah, it's pretty different. I'm walking up a big hill, so I'm kind of out of breath. This is a wash and dry if you need to do your laundry. Yes, yes, yes. And it also has free parking because I'm going to keep it real. A lot of places don't have free parking. But most, most, most parking lots have free parking. 
and just like all over the city there are no shortage of hills yo there's no shortage of hills in the city there's tons of hills yo now once again i don't see no homeless people down here now this is pretty much the black neighborhood this is the other black neighborhood in the city so San Francisco kind of has two neighborhoods that are like majority like not majority but like lots of black people live there majority black people you got the TL you got sort of the Fillmore district but you also got the Bayview <laughs> so the Bayview yeah there's a lot of black people living in the Bayview but also a lot of Asians living in the Bayview a lot of you know Chinese a lot of um maybe not, not not as many Filipinos because Filipinos is our um living more in Daly City, but definitely, um, and then you also have action like this going on, you know, people stopping at the red, at the green light, stopping in that car, you know, I mean, you know, people do that downtown too. Third Street, y'all. Now, this was just like a freestyle video. Like I say, I don't really know that much about Third Street. I don't know that much about Bayview, but I'm pretty sure after I put this video up, there's gonna be people in the comments like, yo, you should've went here, you should've went there. Well, if you think I should've went there, let me know that place <laughs> and maybe I'll go. <laughs> so put it in the comments down below. And of course, there, there's there's churches around here on Third Street. There's churches up here. We got a um, what do we got? This is a po not a post office. It's a library. You gotta have a library. And then you got Salvation Army. I mean, come on, this is random stuff. Like y'all know what I'm saying. But anyway, I'm out. Like, comment, subscribe. Peace out, yo.